Okay, so we picked up our new kitten today, and I had to run to Dollar Tree to get a few things for her. I'll show you guys her real quick. Hold on. Let me take off the ring light. I don't want to blind her. Can you see her? A little more. She's just sleeping in a little box. Mm -hmm. She's like seven weeks old. She just started on solid food, so we were able to get her today. My boyfriend's aunt's cat had kittens, and she promised us one. But we wanted to do the right thing and keep her with the mother to have her breast milk instead of doing formula. So now that she was finally on solid foods, we went to get her today. Last week, we already had gone to the store to pick up litter and all that stuff. But then I realized we didn't have any cat toys and we bought litter, but we forgot the scoop, which is kind of important when it comes to litter. So I ran into Dollar Tree for this. I got one of the stick ones. I've had kittens before and I know how obsessed they are with these. So can't wait for her to play with this. And we were told she's very playful. So, and then I got not bad for a buck. It comes with six balls with bells inside. So she can play with these. I got a little bowl while she's still on milk until she transitions to water. This was not Dollar Tree, but we ran into Family Dollar, Family Dollar to get kitten chow for her. Everything else is Dollar Tree. I don't even get a nice big bag of, like that from Dollar Tree, I wish. Then we got cat pan liners. They say it's easier to clean the litter box. We'll see how that goes. And there's one more cat thing, and then I'll show you guys some random stuff. That's the last cat thing. It's the cutest thing. And it's the thing I can't seem to find right now. Well, I'll, when I find it, I'll show you guys. But it's basically one of these bowls, but instead of a jingle bell in it, it's a, a, like a little fake mouse. It's for her to chase. So it's so cute. But then while I was there, I picked up toilet bowl cleaner. I was told for a dollar this works really well. So we'll see how that goes. Oh, look. And you're not looking for it. See, it's a bowl with a little fake mouse inside. And then I got a pack of these. I know I have these somewhere, but I couldn't find them, so I, I just bought a bag. I seen these on a YouTube video. I figured I'd give it a shot for a doll. The girl said it works for her. It, it stops her from grinding her teeth, and I do that all the time. So this, let's see if this helps. I'm trying really hard to stop my habits. I even bought this special nail polish that makes you, uh, you not bite your nails because it has a bitter taste. I've been biting my nails since I was a toddler. And ever since this whole COVID-19 thing, I just realized how often my hands are in my mouth and it's kind of grossing me out. I have a project I was trying to work on this morning with a um, dry erase board that I'm trying to get to stick to my desk, like on the side, so I can just pull it off when I need it. And I had some of this, but I didn't realize it didn't have the sticky side. This one specifically has the sticky side, so I can stick it to the desk. It's just like a Velcro strip. I also saw this on a YouTube video. She said this worked perfectly to clean her oven. And they had the name brand, the Billow, Brillo, but it only came with two. Or you could buy the Scrub Buddies brand and get five. And that was the brand she bought was the Scrub Buddies. So I figured for a dollar, I'd give it a shot. I'm going to try to be doing a lot of cleaning since I'm stuck at home. I also saw this on a YouTube video, the moisture eliminator. We have a very, under our bathroom sink, there's like a slow drip. So I obviously it's not gonna stop a drip, but if it can suck up some of the moisture, that will be great. So figured I'd give this a shot. I know a lot of YouTubers that do Dollar Tree hauls recommended it. And then I got this, this, I could not believe how many they had and they didn't have a limit. So I got six, I gave one to my mom, I kept five. But uh, it makes five gallons of Lysol. So uh, I have a gallon and I'll just have to put some water in it and figure out how to measure this out. But I bought three of the brand new day 
which is mango and hibiscus. They had a whole end cap full of these. Oh, brand, this one's brand new day. I guess it's like a collection. I bought two of this one, mandarin and ginger lily. But you can never have too much Lysol nowadays with everything going on. This will go perfect with my scrub buddies. I absolutely love LA Totally Awesome. I've had, my mom is the one that introduced me to it. She has been using it for years. She loves it with the oven, especially. She said it's really good at cutting grease. Then when I started seeing it on all the Dollar Tree YouTubes, I was like, wow, my mom was onto something. While well, I went to Dollar Tree today and I saw that they have a specific one now for the oven. So definitely curious to try this out. I'm cooking a lot more, I'm baking a lot more, so my oven's been getting cleaned daily. <laughs> Oh, I also saw this in a YouTube video. The girl swore it was amazing, and my boyfriend loves lemonade. So I figured I'd give it a shot. I found this on an end cap full too, because I wasn't specifically looking for it. I was kind of just running in trying to get cat stuff and go. Because I know how I am, I do get distracted. But it was just there at the end cap. Same thing, I wasn't even really looking for the Lysol or the cleaners. It was like as I was walking by. They had a display, and I grabbed it. And then I did go into the fridge section. I was going to try to get a carton of eggs. Didn't get it. But I got a bag. I'm going to make chicken stir-fry. I already have a bag with a stir-fry mix. But honestly, this one was a dollar, and it's better. The one I paid, I think it was only $1.50, really. But I, I honestly think that bag is smaller. It might not be. It might be the same size. But it didn't look like it had, I don't know, this, then again, I'm not opening it and seeing it. It's just what the picture is. So I'm being, I'm judging the bag by the picture. But I don't know, it has, the, the picture just has so much broccoli, so many carrots. The mix looks better than the one I have already in my freezer. So I, I'm probably just going to end up using both. I might do a big batch. That way my boyfriend has lunches for work. He's still working because he's an essential worker. And this way it's some leftovers for me so I don't have to cook. Although right now, I really don't mind cooking, but... I have a big thing of chicken that I need to thaw. So instead of me putting it like half in the freezer, I might just do one big batch of chicken stir fry. We'll see. And then I just bought a pepper stir fry. I do have one red pepper in my fridge. But uh, I was now that I'm making a bigger batch, this might come in handy. And now that was it from Dollar Tree. Now, um, I did have to get wet cat food for her. The, uh, the girl we got her from said that she's been mixing the wet and the dry and that she's been eating it up so i got this is the one she recommended because it specifically says high in protein it's the turkey with turkey and gravy the frisky treasures so i bought seven well my boyfriend technically bought it very random i don't know i'm very exact i buy like even numbers so this is like bothering me right now but uh Oh, no, he did buy six. So, see, it's not just me. Most people buy even numbers. This is the one she gave. She supplied one can and one bag of uh, dry food. She wasn't sure if we had anything at the moment. And then Walmart is one of those stores I do not like going to. I know people that have worked there. I know they're not that great to their workers. And, you know, they're like a billion-dollar corporation because they could definitely pay more. And I try not to support stores like that. I honestly go to a store, it's a little family market that I actually worked at for eight years. I go there more, um, why not support a small family business, but due to everything right now, they're closed. I don't blame them, you know, it's all family in that market and they want to keep their family safe. So I applaud them for that. So I did, uh, so my boyfriend ran into Walmart because like I said, I don't even like going there. And while he was there, he was able to score a carton of eggs. He actually bought two, one for us and one for my mom. And that's it, but figured I'd show you guys, in case it's interesting anyone, the nail polish that I got. I told myself, since I have this time off, I wanted to make use of it. So we had just moved into an apartment, so it's been coming in handy because I've been unpacking and decorating and can't do everything because like I do need to buy a couch and... I need to buy a few things off of storage and organization, and I want to go to Ikea, but they're closed. 
but everything that can get done has basically been done. So once everything opens again, everything will be done fairly quickly. I've been organizing things. It's been good. But um, this is the one I bought. I got on Amazon. I read the reviews. This one said it was even safe for kids. Because I think that's people's biggest misconception of this or worry, which I don't blame them, is because of the bitter taste. They worry it's like a lot of chemicals. And by putting it in your mouth, you're exposing yourself to those chemicals. Not that I'm a kid, but I figured... Why not protect myself? So it says right here, it's seven free. It does not contain seven of these things for formaldehyde. And I can't even pronounce the rest, so I'm not even going to try. But I will show you guys right there. So uh, they say it takes three weeks to break a habit. And I go back to work. If everything goes according to plan, I go to work in three weeks. So... We'll see how this is. I always, always wanted to buy this. But before my job now, like I said, I worked at a grocery store. And I was so, so nervous that I was going to put my hands in my mouth. And then make an ugly face or start gagging. Because I am very sensitive to things like that. And then creep out the customers in front of me. I, I didn't want to do that. So that was always my excuse. I always said, I'll do it on my own. I'll do it on my own. And I would go for a little while and not bite. But then I'd start biting the skin or the cuticles. Then when that was done, okay, no, I can't bite the skin and the cuticles. I'd go back to biting the nails. I can never beat like both habits at the same time. Because I would just replace one for the other. So, and then at my current job, it's at a school. I work with kids. And I, again, I just, I was worried. I didn't want to gag. I didn't want to make a face or anything like that. So um, I had told myself I have summers off now, so I was planning on doing it during summer vacation. But why not? No. Especially this, like I said, everything that's been happening, I realize now how often I put my fingers in my mouth and kind of grosses me out. Especially when I was at the grocery store and I was touching money all day. Then I wonder why I get sick so easily. I'm lucky nothing more serious has happened. I know people, people have told me stories of them getting infections and all this stuff. And they're like, oh, if you listen to my story, it'll stop you never stops me i'm like i literally touch money all day guys and it doesn't stop me so it's at the point where i'm biting the bullet and telling myself clearly i can't do it on my own and i'm gonna i bought this to help me so basically if you guys are curious it just says apply one to two coats on the entire nail allowing thorough drying of each coat if applying base coat so you can put it on top of like regular polish apply no more biting under base coat oh you actually put it onto the regular polish hmm after two weeks, remove and refresh original application. Treatment will prevent nail biting and thumb sucking. That's more for the kid's side. By giving distasteful taste. Can be used over polish. Will help with nail growth. Which that was something I was looking for too. It's not just that you stop biting your nails. But this actually adds like vitamins to the nails and stuff. Which I definitely need because I don't have nails. So <laughs> it'll be nice to finally see like longer healthy nails. I don't think I'll ever have long nails feel like after all these years i don't think i'll be able to function but i definitely want better nails than what i have now now this is already me trying not to bite so it's not super duper short you're not seeing any red any bleeding because trust me it's happened but you can't see like see i have like that that skin exposed right here this thumb is probably the worst i'm always biting the thumbs the most so I'm hoping this works. I'm really excited for this. I ordered this on Amazon like two weeks ago. I'm so used to Prime two-day shipping, but I know everything's been delayed. They're sending items that are more important. 100% understand. So I, it said from April 1st to April 13th. So I'm happy it came in now when it did. I ordered it like the last week of March. So um, maybe I'll give you guys an update on this if it's interesting anyone. I'm definitely curious to see myself. I hope I... Did the right research. There were so many different brands. You know, I just wanted something that finally works. And, you know, they even say, like, I was like, oh, so am I going to have to put it on the skin so I don't bite the skin? But obviously, as you're putting the finger in your mouth, like, even if it's not directly on the skin part, as I'm trying to bite the skin, I'm going to taste it from the nail. So we'll see how it goes. But, uh, yeah, basically, so that's my new kitten my dollar tree haul and very tiny barely anything from walmart we were in and out thank god so uh, i'll give you guys one more view of the kitty i don't want to blind her but she's like right there <laughs> she's all gray so we named her smoky my boyfriend came up with that name i was just gonna be generic and say gray but uh I like smoky better and we're really excited and it's actually good timing since i don't have work for a month 
she can get used to the apartment and get used to us before she spends some alone time. <laughs> All right. Thanks for watching, guys. Everyone, please stay safe.